One of the couples I've been working with for the last three to four years have now retired. And they first came in because they wanted to make sure that they were on track, that they could retire safely and securely, that they had thought of everything, that they had stress tested everything that they needed to stress test, and that they didn't miss anything. And so we put together a plan and it revealed that they absolutely can retire now and they can do that safely and securely. They are not gonna run out of money before the end of their life. And we did all of the stress testing that was needed to know that that is absolutely gonna be the case. But before they retired, they wanted to come back in and revisit everything. Look at the numbers again, look at the projections again, talk through all of the stress testing again. And that's really very common because retirement is letting go of the work, the income, everything that you've had for all these years and stepping into a position where you're now supporting yourself from social security, possibly a pension, but that's rare, and then the assets that you've saved. And that is scary because there's a lot of unknowns in the future ahead of us. And those unknowns can create anxiety. And so I want to talk about that today, about being able to reduce the anxiety that you're going to feel when you're getting ready to retire or even during retirement. And the way that you do that is to understand what you cannot control versus what you can control. You cannot control the markets, the Fed, or interest rates. Yes, those are going to impact your portfolio. But since you don't have any control over what those are going to be, what you can control is your portfolio allocation. How are you allocated to line up with what you need in retirement? And how are you managing the risk so that that stays on track over your retirement years? Another thing that you cannot control is inflation. And Inflation has been high lately. It was not, uh, you know, that much of a thought until just recently, and now it's on everybody's mind. You cannot control inflation, but you can control your spending plan, and you can know what adjustments will you make if you have to in order to offset and combat some higher inflation in the future. So you can control the spending plan, you can control your expenses, you can control the fees that are being charged on different accounts, uh, and with that, you can then know what you're gonna do if you're retired and you need to make an adjustment. You also cannot control the elections or tax law, other law changes. Uh, and of course, we're in an election year right now and there's a lot of focus on who's gonna be the next president, but we also need to be thinking about who's gonna be in Congress. Are, are the parties in charge going to shift? And if so, how is that going to impact tax law, estate planning law, uh, you know, everything that might impact your plans? We don't know. And you can't control that. But what you can control is just thinking ahead, thinking about your current plan, the tax plan you have in place, the estate plan you have in place, and staying on top of changes as they come so that you can make adjustments to those plans to keep you on your best path. Last but not least, you cannot control the news. And the news is 24-7 uh, and as you know, it's highly, highly motivated to get you to click on the articles. Clickbait headlines, clickbait topics, and that's not necessarily feeding you with the information that you really need for your plan. You can't control that. What you can control is how much of that you consume. You can limit your consumption so that you're actually just feeding yourself the information that you need for your own plan. And a good advisor will help you with that. An advisor will help you focus on here is what's important for you. Here's what you need to know for your plan. Here's what you need to know for your future and allow you to let go of all of the rest of that clickbait so that you can free up your mind, free up your time, eliminate the anxiety that some of that can cause and actually spend your retirement on the things that bring you enjoyment and not the things that raise up a higher level of anxiety. 
And so an advisor is somebody that will be there for you. They will help you focus on what's important in your plan. They will stand between you and making a bad decision. And they will ensure that your plan stays on track as changes happen to ensure that you are always on your best path in your retirement. And so think about that. And if you don't have an advisor that's playing that role in your life, then find a good one. You can reach out to us here at Best Path Advisors. There are other many good advisors out there. So find a good one that you can connect with that will help you walk through your retirement safely and securely.